so for the ones we did wrong, I'll do a tattoo tour again at some point. So now that we just started eating. Anyways, realized that I never actually filmed the tattoo tour or edited the parts where I was correcting Jenny and all the stuff that they got wrong. And it was hell trying to take these photos because I decided to just take them in my room with my phone. The first tattoo I got is this heart on my middle finger and it was done by a friend from high school. They were doing stick and pokes on themselves and I would see it on their Finsta and I was like, can you give me one? She gave me the stick and poke in her car. Then we did the second one, the smiley face. And it was so funny because she was more nervous than I was because it was her first time giving a stick and poke to somebody else. And then I bought a kit. I started doing them on myself and that's these four dots was my first one because I was like, let me think of something simple. A little dots to represent my siblings. Light work. The frowny face because I realized I kind of want, I like when there's a balance. They don't have to be the same exact tattoo nor do they have to actually be cohesive theme. But I just want tattoos in the same place. So then after, I wanted to do the most uncomfortable thing I could for myself. The sun on my elbow. And then the moon on the other elbow. Mushroom on my ankle. Actually, no. I have it listed the other way around, so maybe I'm wrong. But I feel like I did alien first. My first professional tattoos were the XO and AH that I got from an apprentice when I went to Utah with Emily, which those videos are also on my channel. Treble clef, the bass clef, what, what the fuck? After the bass clef, then I have the orange juice carton that's on my knee. Then on the other knee, the ghost wearing a party hat, riding a skateboard. Then I have the planet and the leaflet. I have the oh no on my thumb. I really was out of it this day. It's also when I did the semicolon, the oh no. Like I just started tattooing like I didn't think of what I was putting I just started going and it ended up being oh no and I probably should have thought about it more before permanently etching it into my body but I like it who's fucking calling me I will call her back Ugh! me to continuity because I don't fucking remember where I put the camera then we have the star on my pointer finger and then an asterisk key on my wrist keyhole not lock everyone says lock and key but this is just a keyhole moon sun and rising i'm an aries moon a uh, no i'm an aries sun aries is my main fucking sign leo moon cancer rising then i have the dna and atom on my other side there's supposed to be a beaker but i couldn't draw it that shit kept coming out fugly so i gave up and just had the two i have a wave and then the envelope that is pretty much not there anymore on the other finger that I need to touch up. And the wave and the envelope are matching my friend Emma, who has been on one <laughs> video on my channel. Then the no face that's on my hip from Spirited Away. Opposite thigh is just a ghost with a heart. Frog prints in the maxillae. I got done at Witch City Inc. in Salem. The maxillae, we have like matching. JC has the mandible. On another trip to Salem, two more tattoos. These weren't done by Brie, these were done by Seven, and it's the bat and the horn skull. The Emma, who I have the wave and envelope with, we have matching baby on our lower backs. Just didn't want to be super uncomfortable and trying to do it to myself, so she did this one. Yeah, I think it came out really good, and it was her first time doing a stick and poke, and I don't know if she would ever do it again, but... <laughs> I could force her. The next one I did was a flaming heart on my like pelvic bone near that. A goth fish on my hip, which I got done at Pearl Street Tattoo Shop. The artist was Erin. Then I did the butterfly on my wrist. Then the elephant. We have two 11s matching tattoos with Emma and JC, who they've both been on. The channel before for a karaoke room that we go to when we found the three of us we kept getting room 11 then the next one which is my favorite one because it's the one i've been dreaming about since i was 16 years old and it is the girl with the flower fro jade who is also at pearl street tattoo club i think i said something else earlier but that's what it's called pearl street tattoo club shout out jade who's no longer at pearl street tattoo club though then we have the little blob friend on my elbow i think that's another matching one with emma the emma with envelope wave not the 11 emma 
so is the cloud. Emma and I would see each other, and then we just, like, our, us hanging out was stick and pokes, pretty much. The next one, good kid, bad decisions. Then I did amen and a cross on my finger. I'm not super religious, but I feel connection to, like, faith in general, Christianity specifically, because that's what I was raised around. On the other is still here. It's giving semicolon, as you know. The next tattoo was in New York by this artist named Cavo, who I had seen on Instagram, and I loved their work, and then had a New York trip planned. I was like, please, I want something, and so I just did, like, a random flash, but I would love to book her again and just have her a free reign on this side and just fill it up and I have like an idea of the concept I want whatever you think of this quote and just set like a monetary like limit be like hey would you be willing to do this to have like creative freedom just on my arm because I really like really like her work the next was this little watermelon the mountains the reason I have so many I don't want to do just one stick and poke because it feels like a waste of a needle because they're small then the next ones i did were the playing cards so something i fully stole offline that i saw but i did it with angel numbers and i looked up ones that i felt seemed like relevant to me but i don't even remember what they meant i'll be so honest maybe i'll put them on screen the last one most recent one which was feels like so long ago but it was back in like it might have been may so five months anyways got it in new york when we first arrived in new york and got off of the bus there was a sign that said like flash tattoos for this much and I was like so I have to do that now they were not what they were advertised by the way it was more expensive than that but I liked it but that's all my tattoos now let's proceed to me doing this all over again as I correct Jenny on the tattoos that she misplaced couldn't remember but you said the hand flower, mm -hmm. this, mm -hmm. correct. The woman, correct. Mm -hmm. Mandible, you got on the correct side. I. Frog, you also said correct. Heart, correct. The baby. Oh, I forgot to ask which side. No, I said lower right. You gotta point it here. Nah, watch it. I, you I did point, point it here. Yeah, I know that. I don't remember. No, I know that. Yeah. I'm not. Okay, cutting that out. Back the lock and key, you said we're here. They're here. They're on my wrist. Damn. Yeah, this is a snowflake. What are you talking about? That's an asterisk. It's a snowflake. No, it's the opposite of the star. Okay, now I can't. I was trying to think. I was like, what the fuck snowflake do I have in my body? I don't have one. Okay, then I'll give you plus one. We'll recalculate your score later. I'll edit it in. The cloud? It is on... No, I said on the hood. Yeah? Hold on, where's my cloud at? Right there. Oh, yeah. You said Man. it was... Oh shit, I gave you points for that. That was. I thought you were right. <laughs> Minus point five. The playing card, you got correct. The cross is here. I don't know where you said that was. It was like here. And the amen is here. Um, oh, you said it on the opposite side. Yeah. So I gave you 2.5 because I couldn't figure it out. You got the oh no correct. Then it's the comma. The power is on yes. Yeah, it's not. The four dots. You said we're on my middle finger, they're on my ring finger. Mm. You said good kid, bad choices, it's bad decisions. Okay. So I gave you some points. You got no face. You got my big three, that's here. Across from the big three is the DNA and the... Oh, yeah. To be honest, I don't know what else is there. No, I the know. nucleus. The orange juice carton is on my knee. Right here, across from that, is the ghost wearing a party hat riding a skateboard. I should remember that. Then I also have the planets and the leaflets. The little guy on my hip, Kava did. It was a little horned guy. Oh! And then the dog face you got. This is a little alien with a leaflet. <laughs> and some people call it a radish. Um, so not a strawberry. See, I could only remember like the outline and then something on top. So I was like, strawberry. But I give you a point for that. The smiley faces are here. Mm. Smiley and frowny. The watermelon is here. There's also this little guy. Yeah, you have an elephant. He's just a little guy. But yeah. The elephant, the butterfly. Mm. My 11s mm -hmm. inside here. You forgot the Utah AH. 
in the XO. My um, music. No. Yeah. Treble and bass clef. The wave. The envelope is in here, but it is fading. I need to do it again. Still here. I think that's the don't be sad you're thinking of. <laughs> the star, you got correct. Snowflake, I guess. Oh, you got the... Did I not give you the flaming heart? Oh, no, I have that. Let's go down my list. The heart, my milk, paper, smiley face, four dots, run a face, sun, moon. Oh, the mushrooms on my other ankle. Oh, yeah. I was going to ask you about that. The alien, XO, change, check my face clap, orange heart, and what's well, my heart, whatever. Okay, four, planet, leaf planet, only owls, semicolon, star, and asterisk, um, key and people, not key, the big three, the DNA and atom, wave on my finger envelope, no face tattoo, dang, ghost with heart, oh shit, I forgot about that one. Where's that one? It's the o opposite of the no face, it's this one, the big ghost, holding a heart, it's on my thigh. I have a matching one with Draco, except Draco's is holding a mushroom. You got the frog prints <sighs> and the maxillae, you forgot the... The bat. I know, I forgot skull. those two big ones. Um, Fifty four tattoos. So let's recalculate your score. So it is now 110 out of 180. 61! Hi. Hello. Yes. Hello. Hi, Robbie. Uh, I was wondering if I could help the Oh, yeah. Yeah.